Hey, today I want to talk to you about bikes and how to make sure you buy the correct size one. I don't know if you realize this, but there are different sizes for different people. And if you go to a professional bike shop, they're actually going to measure you out and make sure it's the right size bike for you. But if you go over to Walmart or Kmart or whatever, you're probably going to walk over and say, okay, I want that blue one or I want that green one because it really looks kind of cool. It may not even be the right size for you. So what I want you to do is whether you've got a bike at home or you're thinking about getting a bike and you're at the store, I want you to take a look at uh, the size of that particular bike. So I want you to get over, straddle this particular bar and I want you to be flat footed. So put your feet on the ground and I want you to see that you have one to two inches between this particular pole and your inseam or your groin area because if you don't have that distance or if you have too much, it's not the right size bike for you. So you want one to two inches. That's the ideal measurement for you. Now, if you happen to be looking at a mountain bike, I want two inches between that pole and yourself. So it should be right around two inches, maybe two and a half, somewhere in that range. It's real important that you get the right size bike to begin with. Otherwise, you're gonna have other problems such as uh, knee issues because you're not pedaling correctly. Uh, but anyway, Next thing I want you to look at is the ability to move your handlebars up and down and the ability to move your back seat up and down. Because what you should be doing is this particular seat should be between one and two inches higher than your handlebars. I don't care what kind of handlebars you happen to have, you should have one to two inches of height from this down to this. So if you haven't looked at this or if you haven't looked at your bike, I want you to go back out there and look at it today and make sure you resize it to the correct height. Now obviously you've got an issue with how you're pedaling, so you're going to adjust your seat first. Once you adjust your seat to your pedals, then I want you to adjust your handlebar so it's one to two inches below the seat. Thanks for watching. Now don't forget to subscribe.